Well, hello there, and welcome back to my channel. This is still November, and my second graphic novel is almost ready. Hopefully, by December 1st, I'll have something to share with you. So that's cool to me. All right, for right now, though, I just wanted to share this image with you. It's one of the few paintings I've ever done, and I did this one several, several years ago. The actual painting is about four foot by four foot, and it's of a minotaur. Now, for a while, I had an avatar into my world that was a minotaur. I would write stories through my fantasy world as me in my avatar. I guess it was kind of therapeutic, for whatever that was worth, and it was my entertainment. Now, this was well before WoW, and instead of playing D&D or other RPG type board games, or computer games, it's how I let my imagination run wild. So please, anyone else who escapes into their own fantasy art, it's okay guys, you're not weird. Well, not any weirder than me, at any rate. So, I haven't used this avatar in quite a number of years, but that's alright. I guess I moved on. I'm doing other projects, and I may go back to this world. But for right now, I'm doing other things. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm going back to it. I'm going to go back to it soon. But, And I do have plans for that in the works right now, so... Stay tuned for all that. For right now though, let me bring you something else. In one of my earlier videos on this channel, I did a drawing of a character called a Craptopus. It was one of the first I did while I was still filming in the camera and drawing on paper. Who knows? I may just go back to that every once in a while here. Well, here's the original picture I did of a Craptopus. I did it about a year or so before that. And this was actually in a competition, and it won a ribbon. That's right, I have an award-winning piece right here, folks. Notice how large it is, or how small in comparison the submarine is to relative size of the monstrous beastie. It's an homage to the monster movie genre like King Kong, Godzilla, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, and all of that. So, I had a lot of fun doing this piece. Okay, here's one more for the day. Now, how about a multi-headed hydra in a bird's eye perspective as it wraps itself around a castle that has a moat and plenty of ids and outs? I did this in a perspective class I took when I was at the Art Institute in Austin. And yeah, the class challenged me every day. And I had a blast on taking on these challenges and all these assignments as I push myself every lesson to better make myself a better artist than I did the last drawing in that class. I hope you like what you see. I hope you're as excited about my upcoming books as I am. Maybe, maybe not. But I do plan on the next book coming out in just a few weeks or so. It's my Blood Vein Purgatory Issue 1. And it's going to be available on Amazon. So please check it out. It's the sequel to my first book. Blood Vein Salvation, which is also on Amazon. I'm your artist Logan, and I'm kind of sketchy, and I'll catch you later.